Hi oh guys, welcome back. Right, today we are setting up one of these Invert Mansion awesome enclosures. It's all hand turned on the lathe, on the tops. It's glass. Now these guys at Invert Mansion, obviously we've been doing the charity stuff. Um, they kindly donated this one to be um, raffled off as the very last raffle. Now, to post this, actually um, puts me in fear because it is glass so um, what we're going to actually do we're going to um, do it so it's picked up at the Bedford show um, you can either pick it up if you can't make it at the Bedford show which is the 25th of September um, it is possible for you to come at any other day and come and pick it up from me here in Milton Keynes so you get to see all the, the other spider tanks and all that sort of stuff while you're here as well. Which, you know, you might enjoy that one as well. So what we're going to do, it's, um, I've just set this up. So we're going to have a good closer look at it. And then uh, we're going to pop that back and then I'm going to tell you how you can win this awesome Invert Mansions enclosure with Tarantula Tastic Styly inside. Cheers guys. So guys, this is a nice-ish day. We thought we'd just set this up outside. Let's have a good look at it as well. Now the guys at Invert Mansions, one of them is a wood turner. So this has all been hand handmade. So I decided to set it up a little bit because this is going to be picked up by whoever, whoever wins the very very last raffle at the Bedford show or possibly you could pick it up from me if you're not able to make the show the workmanship is awesome and that just slots over that's really that's just a solid piece of wood so that's really sort of heavy as well they do a wide range of different sorts of all these ones usually at every single show obviously i'm going to put all their links down below in the descriptions their website instagram and stuff so they're quite capable of doing whatever you want if you want something completely custom doing We've got some live moss, leaf litter, plant, a few other bits to put in. So as you can see, first bit I added was a nice bit of cork bark tube. So next. Let's go for, because this is, you've got loads of light everywhere. We're gonna go for a real plant because I think as this is a display enclosure it's really gonna benefit from live moss bits of bark as we're gonna make it a bit tarantula tastic we're gonna try and do something a little bit fun Should we go that way? That looks alright. Obviously, we're going to make it as fun as possible. A live moss is. More and more people are using it nowadays, so it certainly does add that little extra bit to it. You have to keep it sort of moist. We get it all from outside. It's starting to come together now. I 
what we did because I think Friday the 13th is sort of my trademark. There's a guy called Mark Musson. Um, he 3D printed it for me. I thought, hey, why not? Let's just add a bit of fun to this. Starting to look a bit, a bit me already. <laughs> Don't forget your old leaf litter. give everything a spray and then come back and have a look. That looks alright. Loads of moss. This will probably be suited for a nice pokey with the humidity because the plants. They do, do these set up at the show. I think get a live plant in there because you're going to get light from everywhere. It's going to do really well. That looks nice. So as you see from the video, it is a quality build. The base is actually fixed on as well. But with the obviously real plants and everything that's going to get a lot of nice light in there to keep them growing a nice little cork bark hiding in there as well so it's pretty much set up ready to go right if you want the chance of winning this awesome awesome enclosure and to pick it up at the bedford show what we're going to do we're going to run run the raffle for a week so we're going to start it on uh, this saturday coming um over on facebook group exotic pets enclosure design um i'm going to start it off saturday morning nine o'clock um i have full details of how to buy tickets and uh everything on the post if you've been following all the raffles you know quite well what the score is and then we're going to leave it until the following saturday so that's the saturday just before the, sh uh, the show on sunday uh, we'll do the live draw on the Saturday evening and then whoever wins it can either, if they're going to the show, they can pick it up from the show or we can make alternative arrangements for you to come and pick it up um, from me or um, I've got a couple of people up near Coventry or whatever, we might be able to get it to somewhere near you um, because there'll be loads and loads of people there possibly invert mansions or also because they're up north uh we might be able to organize them so you can pick it up from them directly as well um we'll just see we'll see who wins and um, um what what we can do with it so apart from that guys um a massive huge thank you to invert mansions themselves um i'm gonna bungle their links down below their instagram their website facebook everything please do check out their website and stuff They've been going a little while now, and um, I know the guys quite well from doing all the shows and stuff. They are absolutely awesome guys. They're really, really cool to go and have a chat to. So if you're at one of the shows, please do pop along and say hi and check it out. Because this is not the only style they do. They do loads and loads of different slinging closures. But check out the website. They'll have tons on there and their Instagram. They're always posting stuff on there as well. So please do check out. Give them a follow. Um see them at the shows apart from that guys this is the last one the last prize of this raffle and um yeah it's been a hell of a lot of work but um we've raised a ton a ton of money and money over 1500 quid now so this is what um whatever we get there now we're adding over because i think the 1500 was the target so we reached and passed that this weekend so 
apart from that guys thank you so much for all your support on this one really do like this enclosure i hope you like what i've done with it uh invert mansions um i thought i'd give it my own little little bit of a twist so it's something uh a little bit different plus i had my little bit of horror into it as well apart from that guys yes thank you so much for watching please comment down below tell me what you think of the enclosures hit that subscribe button hit that notification bell it notifies you of upcoming videos doesn't cost you a penny but it does mean a lot to me apart from that guys i shall see you later